How do you win during the DCF investigation process against the Massachusetts Department of Children and Families? One of the most important things you can do is know your time standards. You make time your ally, not your enemy. You do not want to go into this situation with DCF not knowing what are the time frames. For example, if it's an emergency 51B investigation, which is the DCF investigation process, you've got five days. That does not include Saturday, Sundays, or holidays. On a non-emergency DCF 51B investigation, the investigation process is 15 days. No Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, no Saturdays or Sundays, and no holidays. That's really important to know where you are in the process. When it comes to the assessment, you got 60 days. 60 days to get the meaning of life and value life. Then at the end of that, they determine whether or not you need an action plan. An action plan is going to be good for six months. So you're either going to be involved with them for a very short period of time, the case is unsupported, or you could be involved with them for a very lengthy period of time during the assessment. And what's the great equalizer that levels the playing field? It's called an attorney, barrister, counsel, esquire, lawyer. Get legal counsel. So you get great legal advice and find somebody that's a specialist in DCF law that has years of experience. You can't beat what a lawyer can do for you. And any client that represents themselves, you don't know what you're doing. And what you don't know is what's going to get you into trouble. So you're going to want to take your time and make sure you make a good decision, a good selection, a good choice. Get yourself a lawyer.